everyone, my name is Anna and I started my research masters at Durham University in October. My research is focused on a volcanic debris avalanche deposit and the shear zone that was generated during its formation. I hope that you'll find interesting the intersection between rock mechanics and volcanoclastic sedimentology. Specifically, I'm looking at the relationship between microtextures in my shear zone and the physical characteristics of the debris avalanche, such as slip rate. Uh, we ultimately hope this will be of use from a hazard mitigation perspective. I'll run through some photos, shear zone imagery, and my plans for experimental work. Ascension Island is a small ocean island volcano in the South Atlantic, 90 kilometres west of the Mid-Atlantic Ridge, and the debris avalanche deposit that I'm interested in is two kilometres squared and originated from the partial collapse of the Green Mountain Scoria Cone. The shear zone is at the base of the deposit and is a few centimetres thick, as you can see from the field photos, but it's more clearly seen in hand specimen where it's finer grained, indurated, and has quite defined boundaries. Here are some backscattered scanning electron microscope images of the shear zone. Uh, these six images were taken through a five centimetre transect and for scale each box is just over a millimetre wide. I'm interested in pore space and interconnectivity and how these decrease towards the centre of the shear zone, as well as grain roundness, size and sorting and how these develop with different shear. I'm also looking at jigsaw fit textures where grains have been mechanically pulled apart but not disintegrated completely. My experimental work will take place on the high velocity rotary shear apparatus in Durham in the coming weeks and I'll be shearing fragments of green mountain scoria under different conditions to see if I can mimic these textures. I'll then examine my experimental samples on the scanning electron microscope and compare the similarities and differences between the natural and experimental textures. Ultimately, this is with the aim of investigating the relationships between shear parameters and the microtextures they produce, hypothesising possible triggers for the event and seeing if there's potential for a similar event on Ascension Island. Thank you.